What's up guys, Serge here. So Vivo became the center of attraction at CES 2018 just because they introduced the world's first working mobile device with an in-screen fingerprint scanner. Remember few days before, Synaptics has announced that they are going to work with top 5 smartphones manufacturer but they did not specify any name or any specifications of their trailblazing fingerprint technology. But now it's confirmed that among these top 5, one is Vivo, a Chinese company which is not so famous around but works for their user satisfaction. Now when we talk about this technology, it takes about 0.7 seconds to unlock a device. It's slow compared to 0.25 seconds that we are having right now, but I am sure that it will improve when implemented on a retail product. Vivo X20 Plus has surfaced on Tena's official website and China's FCC equivalent regulatory agency pairs the moniker with some very familiar photos and specs. According to these photos, there is no rear and front fingerprint sensors and it's therefore safe to expect the in-display fingerprint recognizing the Vivo X20 Plus coming with a full-view 6.43 Full HD Plus OLED screen as well as a Snapdragon 660 chipset paired with 4GB RAM and 128GB internal storage. As Vivo is known for their camera quality, it's not possible that we will end this video without talking about the camera specs. Vivo X20 Plus and Nougat device with 3800 mAh battery will feature 12 plus 5 megapixel dual rear camera lens and a single 12 megapixel front camera lens. This device is expected to cost at about $575. So yeah, tell me what you think about this in the comments down below. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.